Hey yo, what is up, ladies and gentlemen, this is Power Owner, and today we're here with another episode of Minecraft Factions, and uh, yes, we are inside of our base right now, we are not at the server spawn, we are inside of our base, and I mean, this is how crazy this season is gonna be looking like. Now, before anything actually gets started, the first thing we had to do was run to a corner, and we managed to get one of the corners here on the server. Now, the server actually started out with 16 corners in total, so this means actually we don't have to gen our walls four ways, instead just two ways. Next up, we went ahead and set up ourselves a sugarcane farm. I mentioned this in the previous episode, but sugarcane is definitely the best way to get started here on the server, because you're going to be making a lot of in-game money, which you can later use to gen walls for your base or you can use it for buying spawners for instance. Now we were setting up a massive sugarcane farm and as you guys can see in the background right now we are printing in this farm. Now if you guys didn't know the server does have schematic enabled so you can actually do slash printer on and it's going to be much easier to print. You're going to be printing without any box etc etc and it's going to go fairly fast for you but this sugarcane farm is making us quite a bit of in-game money and don't forget guys there are things like the shop wave hoe which means farming is gonna be much much faster anyways this is how our sugarcane farm looks like today and as you guys can see this farm is freaking massive and let me quickly go ahead and demonstrate to you guys how does the shockwave hoe actually work and as you guys can see it's a 7x7 shockwave cell multiplier by 20% so let me go ahead and fly in here and take a look at this guys oh my god I showed this in the previous episode as well but this is extremely OP and as you guys can see we are farming sugarcane so freaking fast and we can just fly really quick and just sell everything behind us and around us and well we are making definitely pretty decent in-game money so yeah sugarcane is definitely one of the best ways to get started here in the server. Anyways, now that we have our money making method set up, we are gonna go ahead and start doing some base work. First things first, we are gonna start trenching out this base area. And as you guys know, trenching is very important so people can actually skip our walls and shoot from the bottom and then shoot upwards later towards the end of the base. So we gotta make sure that our walls reach a bedrock and for us to do that, well, we gotta clear out all this netherrack around our base and that's exactly what we're gonna go ahead and do. Yes, as you guys just saw, we have finished our base, and in a second, I'm gonna give you guys a proper tour of this base. But before anything, I just want to say a huge shout out to our faction here because I didn't even get the chance to gen any walls, they were just so freaking quick with this base. It's unbelievable. And right now, we are behind our spawner grinder. And if we go ahead and do F top, as you guys can see, well, we are in F top one position, and we're sort of dominating this position because we're almost two times higher than the second position here which is amazing but anyways we are doing pretty good so far i mean after the grace period things are gonna start to look very interesting so i hope you guys are excited for it and now if you guys are wondering how much money does this right here make well, we make about million every 30 minutes, so every single hour we are making about 2 million coins, which is actually really, really good results, because here on the server their economy isn't as strong as usually, 
So uh, this is actually a pretty OP farm right now, especially considering that the release was just this Saturday. And well, down here we have our faction score, which right now I believe is not upgraded. But later we're going to be upgrading it and it's going to mean that we are going to have strength on our faction's land and enemies are going to have like mining fatigue hunger etc etc so we're gonna be pretty strong on our on land but down here is the collection system and as you guys can see actually let me quickly demonstrate to you guys how much money we are gonna be making right here uh it's not afk for that long but let me quickly just sell everything here and we had about 1.3 million in our balance and just like that we are at 2.3 million so we made ourselves 1 million from selling all of these items right here which is really really good by the way and now I'm gonna show you guys the most exciting part of the base which you guys saw in the intro as well is our factions home Okay, this is our F home and they said right now They're about 80% done with this because it's just taking so long to print in but this F home Looks better than most server spawns and I mean look at this. This is freaking magnificent And this is amazing like honestly and over here. We do have storage storage system as well which is covered by these uh, redstone blocks and obviously water so we're gonna be nice and safe in here boys but honestly this base looks freaking amazing and yo no need to put your hands up but yes this roof art looks freaking amazing and as you guys can see it does actually say Tijuana at the very bottom it might be hard to tell because it's very pixelated but this is our roof art on the top of the base but I want to show you guys the base from the outside because this base is freaking wild as you guys can see we have already finished fully genning all the walls obviously we already finished trenching and uh, well the base is pretty much ready except we also do need to water these walls but uh, yeah pretty much we are ready for the grace period to actually come to an end and this base is pretty freaking wild and i'm not even sure what are these walls right here called like why is this obsidian time to time here i'm not exactly sure but this base looks freaking amazing and it is pretty freaking massive and i can't believe it that they finished it so quickly because i was low-key kind of looking forward to genning some walls and then i get online and then i find out that all the walls are freaking gen already like what look at this guys i mean this is freaking wild like everything is already just need to water this base and remove this Netherrack and we are gonna be pretty much Gucci now guys I'm forgetting to show you one thing as well before today's episode comes to an end and uh, well this is our newsroom I'm not even joking ladies and gentlemen take a look at this to you want a news network filming studio please do not disturb well I'm sorry right now I'm gonna be disturbing this here but anyways as you guys can see there's a little newsstand and well you can do little news here and our faction already recorded one part of the news which is just hilarious and honestly like this is pretty cool this is pretty cool maybe we're gonna have some cool news coming from this room and now i love the fact that there's actually no wall over here so you can actually get pretty cool shots like at some points you can be over here you know recording the newscast or whatever uh but uh yeah anyways this is our base i mean this is our sugarcane farm area and well overall our base looks pretty freaking wild let us know in the comments down below what do you guys think about this base is it 10 out of 10 or what ladies and gentlemen so let me know in the comments down below what do you guys think about this base because I honestly love it and I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. Anyways, today's episode is slowly coming to an end. I do hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like. That would mean a lot to me. And if you're new to the channel, haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing? Subscribe with the notifications on right now and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.